Well, hello, friends. It's your friend Lee, and then the famous, the famous Petter is getting ready to kick some ass. Hello, Petter. Never a man has a man been so kind and so dangerous at the same time as that man right there. <laughs> I embarrass him. <laughs> okay, so I'm in a good mood because I just finished my practice. He's getting ready for his, and uh, it's going good, man. Uh, the bike, the Pink Mistress, is absolutely absolutely the right tool for the job for me i got to do my runs a couple runs with a guy named quinn who's one age group lower younger than me but who's an active racer downhill racer from socal like the whole um boot lake canyon scene and uh it gave me a sense for what the, what the pace is and um that first run i was like whoa i'm not used to going this fast but the second run i hung pretty good and i made a mistake of course um, but I can see where this bike gains speed. It's in the corners. You know, in the straight chatter, of course, I'm losing to the downhill bikes, as expected. But it just carries speed in the smooth sections in the corners very, very well. So I'm going to lean into that. Uh, I've not hit the big jumps. And uh, um, it's clear that I need to. And it's clear that I know how. Like, they're pretty much the same as the, the big jumps on Rainmaker at Winter Park, if you all know that. And tomorrow it should be dry and game on, and I'll follow Petter, and that's good. And uh, I've done what I can. And I also know what too fast feels like. I started winding it up a little bit. I can start feeling my hands tightening, which is a sign that I'm not doing okay. You know, I'm a little it's too much. And the bike got very uncontrollable. So I'm gonna keep it quiet. Except the randomness that's gonna happen in the mud, especially there's a section called Alien Tree that I've not seen anyone ride well yet. Um, that's random and uh, get after it right so tomorrow morning one more practice uh, I'm gonna get those jumps and then a seating run I'm gonna go ahead and qualify first so I can go later in the day when it's drier why not and then we race um, and then we race you know I, I was at a race this Masters Worlds 20 years ago and I've been dreaming about coming back but it seemed impossible with the shoulders and life you know and uh no one's happier to be here than me, man. I'm stoked. Hmm? Yeah.